Military cooks often follow rigid guidelines when preparing recipes for the mess hall, preventing personal creativity. However, the Okinawa Inter-Service Cook-Off has given four teams of military chefs an environment to make use of their creative skills. Service members from the Army, Navy, Marine Corps, and the Air Force went to the event representing their branch of service. The competition's winner will receive a trophy and a year of bragging rights. But this competition will be the last for Marine Staff Sergeant Tevis Mitchell. I want to pass on that, you know, food service isn't just like a, a give, just a give job. Like a lot of times we just serve service people all the time and we, it's a thankless job. But this is more something that's for us, something that we like to do. It's more, it's for us. Please give it up for the United States Marine Corps! The cook-off was also a place for younger chefs to gain experience. Lance Corporal Brittany Schuler said the event was a welcome change of scenery. It was nice to get out of the usual daily routine. You know, it's the same thing cooking in the chow hall. You have to follow the recipe cards and there's not a whole lot of creativity to it. You don't really get to express your own personality, but here we got to, you know, have a little of our own flavor in it. The Navy ultimately won the cook-off, walked away with the trophy, and earned bragging rights, but next year may reveal a new winner. Lance Corporal Lillian Stevens, Camp Foster, Japan.